Hey everyone, today, we have an interesting topic to discuss, why I agree with Squidward from Spongebob Squarepants. Now, before you judge, hear me out. Squidward may seem grumpy and miserable, but there are actually some valid reasons to empathize with him. So let's dive deep into this debate. Point 1. Squidward's desire for a peaceful life One of the key reasons why I agree with Squidward is his longing for a peaceful life. He appreciates tranquility, enjoys his hobbies like art and music, and seeks moments of solitude. In a fast-paced and noisy world, it's natural to crave some calmness and personal space. Squidward's preference for a quieter and more introverted lifestyle may not be the norm, but it's valid nonetheless. Unfortunately, Squidward's attempts at finding peace and quiet are often thwarted by his annoying neighbors, SpongeBob and Patrick. While they mean well, their constant presence and noise can be overwhelming for Squidward. We can all relate to the frustration of being unable to enjoy our personal space. Point 2. Squidward's Aspirations and Frustrations Squidward has dreams and aspirations beyond his job at the Krusty Krab. He's a talented artist and musician, and he constantly seeks opportunities to express his creativity. Unfortunately, he often faces setbacks, criticism, or interruptions from SpongeBob and Patrick, which can be quite frustrating. We can all relate to the feeling of being held back or not being understood. It's especially disheartening when Squidward's artistic endeavors are not appreciated or recognized by others. His passion for art and music is often misunderstood or dismissed by his colleagues and neighbors. This highlights the importance of acknowledging and supporting different forms of creativity, even if they don't conform to mainstream standards. Point 3. Squidward struggles with annoying neighbors Let's not forget Squidward's neighbors, SpongeBob and Patrick. While they mean well. Their overly enthusiastic and intrusive nature can be overwhelming. Squidward values his personal space, but he rarely gets a moment of peace due to their constant antics. Dealing with noisy or annoying neighbors is a challenge many of us face in real life. Moreover, Squidward's attempts at setting boundaries or confronting his neighbors are often met with resistance or ignorance. This highlights the importance of effective communication and respect for personal boundaries in any relationship, be it with neighbors, friends, or colleagues. Point 4. Squidward's expressions of emotions Squidward may come across as grumpy, but he also expresses a range of emotions throughout the series. He experiences sadness, disappointment, and even loneliness. These moments of vulnerability make him relatable and remind us that it's okay to feel and express our emotions, even if society expects us to always be happy and positive. So there you have it. Some reasons why I agree with Squidward from SpongeBob SquarePants. While he may be a fictional character, his struggles and desires resonate with many of us. It's important to acknowledge that not everyone fits into the happy go lucky mold, and that's perfectly okay. So, next time you watch SpongeBob, remember to appreciate Squidward's perspective too. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next.